Prince Harry's decision to make the United States his primary residence has stirred significant controversy and backlash, particularly among certain American commentators who view his actions and recent criticisms of the royal family as problematic. The Duke of Sussex, along with his wife Meghan Markle, has been living in Montecito, California, since their departure as senior working members of the royal family almost four years ago. Earlier this month, Prince Harry updated his official business records in the UK to indicate that he now resides in the US. This move has been met with sharp criticism from figures such as Lee Cohen, a US commentator who spoke to GBA News about the implications of Harry's decision. Cohen expressed astonishment at Harry's decision to declare residency in a foreign country and potentially renounce his domicile in his birth country. He remarked, It's staggering that a prince of the blood has declared residence in another country, my country, and has no domicile in the land of his birth and even has considered taking citizenship in a foreign country. Further intensifying the controversy are the Duke's recent public criticisms of his family, documented extensively in his memoir, Spare. Cohen criticized Harry for not maintaining a dignified, respectful silence out of respect for his family, which he described as a central pillar of British society. Instead, Harry chose to air family grievances publicly, which Cohen described as unforgivable. The reactions to Harry's actions are not uniformly negative across the United States, but Cohen highlighted a significant portion of the American populace that finds such behavior intolerable. According to Cohen, while some Americans may still regard Harry with affection, others view his criticisms as hypocritical and difficult to accept. On the one hand, Harry claims to still love his family dearly, as he said in interviews, etc. But in his autobiography, he savages them mercilessly, so it's really not appreciated. The hypocrisy is not appreciated, some of us just find it intolerable, Cohen explained. The contrast between the public's perception of the royal family and Harry's personal revelations has led to a complex discussion about the boundaries of public discourse and personal grievances. As Prince Harry continues to navigate his life and career in the United States, the fallout from his explosive memoir remains a topic of heated debate among Americans who follow royal affairs. Harry's bold choices continue to shape his public persona and influence his relationship with both his homeland and his chosen country of residence.